so now I will show you the register move instruction but here is the example here we will move this number to register 0 simply just move R0 comma sharp 76 where R0 will have the value of 76 this is the instruction when the register copies in the processor to the memory here we will talk about ARM diagram you see we have address register value bus register bank incrementer instruction decode and control data and register multiply register barrel shifter a bus alu in data out register so next we will talk about the subtopic of ARM architecture which is the register structure here in register structure there are 16 32 bits you see here a condition code flags processor mode bits and interrupt disable bits this is a diagram wherein you see a status, a status register and CPSR there are seven basic operation modes in ARM the user the user is the unprivileged mode under which most tasks run FIQ FIQ is entered when a high priority interrupt is raised IRQ it is the alternate of the FIQ which means it is a low priority interrupt is raised supervisor is reset and when a software interrupt abort handle memory access violation and death is the undefined instructions and system is the alternate of the user which is privilege mode under which most tasks run 3.1.2 is all about memory access instruction and addressing mode each instruction in the ARM architecture is encoded into a 32-bit word in a reasonably uniform way. Access to memory is provided only by load and start instruction. The basic encoding format for this instruction is move, arithmetic, and logic. It also it specifies a conditional ex execution code RN, RD, and RM. If register RM is not needed, the other info field extends to bit BO. In a load instruction, the operand is transferred from the memory into the general purpose registered name. In the store instruction, the operand transferred from RD into the memory. Conditional execution of instruction a distinctive and somewhat unusual feature of ARM processor is that all instructions are conditionally executed depending on the conditions specified in the instruction. If the instruction is, is executed only if the current state of the processor condition code flag satisfy the condition specified in bits B31 to 28 of in the instruction. Otherwise, the processor 
proceed to the next instruction. One of one of the condition is used to indicate that the instruction is always. So now I will show you the register move instruction. But here is the example. Here we will move this number to register zero. Simply just move R zero, comma. Sharp seventy six, where a zero will have the value of seventy six. So now we will talk about arithmetic and logical instructions. Arithmetic and logical instructions are set of instructions where you can add, subtract, multiply, divide. And logical instruction has OR, XOR, AND, just like that instructions. Here I'll show you an example of arithmetic instruction. Of code RD, RN, and RM. Where you will add R2 and R4. So this is. R2 plus R4 will be the value of R0 and you subtract R6 to R5 and the, ba and the value of the 2 will go to R0 same instructions here R3 plus 17 will be the value in R0 Then here, add R0, R1, R5, LSL, number 4. So here, we will use the multiply, where R1 will be multiplied by R2, and we'll put in R0. Here, MLA, register 0, register 1, register 2, register 3, where you will multiply register 1 to register 2 plus register 3 and the answer will put in register 0 so next I will show you a logical instruction here you will see an AND instruction AND is multiplication where Rn and Rm will be multiplied to each other and the value of them will be put in register D here R0 R0 R1 BIC means bit clear logical operation where you use that in R0 R0 and R1 then you will move the R0 to R3. Here is a table of LDR 